In this video, we'll talk about creating a password reset disk. There is always the possibility that you could forget your user account password, so Windows Vista gives you the ability to create a password reset disk on removable media, such as a USB flash drive or a CD or DVD. You only have to create this disk once, and then you can keep it with you. However, you should keep this disk with you or in a safe place, because anyone will be able to use this disk to access your account. Here's how you create a password reset disk. Click the Start button, and then click Control Panel. Click the User Accounts and Family Safety link. Then click the User Accounts link. In the Tasks list, click the Create a Password Reset Disk link. If you don't have removable media installed, such as a CD or a USB flash drive, a dialog box will appear that tells you to install the disk and try again. After you install the disk, click the Create a Password Reset Disk link again. The Forgotten Password Wizard window appears. Click the Next button. Select the drive you want to save the password key to in the list, and then click the Next button. Type the current user account password in the box. If there is no password, leave the box blank. Click the Next button. If there is already a password reset disk for this user account, you can overwrite the previous disk by clicking the Yes button. The wizard creates the disk. When it's finished, click the Next button. The last step in the wizard reminds you that any previous disks you have created can no longer be used to reset your password. Click the Finish button to close the wizard. 